What is up guys, Left Burst here, and today we're doing a Beyblade battle between uh, the Eternal Driver versus the Revolve Driver. Now we're gonna see which one's better, we're gonna see which one has more stamina. The uh, the old one, the Revolve Driver, which honestly, it's uh, it's it's been a competitive driver, it's been a staple in the metagame for a while now, but recently we've gotten this new driver on Archer Hercules called Eternal, in my opinion, Eternal just seems like an upgrade Revolve, but maybe that's not true, maybe Revolve's still better, so yeah, let's see which one's better, so I'm putting the combo on on Spriggan Requiem Zero, whatever the driver is, and that's basically because Spriggan Requiem is probably, debatably, one of the best stamina types in the game, also debatably one of the best defense types in the game, also debatably one of the best attack types in the game, also, not debatably, the best Beyblade in the world, so yeah, <laughs> let's get this battle started. Also, I'm putting Destroy on it, or a Zero on it, just because, I don't know, it kind of fits the Spriggan Requiem theme. I know, like, Seven's probably better for, like, stamina or whatever, but, like, I, I like Zero. So yeah, let's get this battle started. Three, two, one, go. And I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna, what, what is it called? What's it called? I'm gonna rotate which one gets, like, launched first. And yeah, so the blue one I think is Revolve, and the, the regular color one, that one is Eternal. So yeah, I'm sorry if I sound a bit tired. It's because I just came back from, like, recording, like, four videos straight. And now, now I'm just, like, I'm just kind of, like, uh, I should probably stop recording. So, oh! Did Revolve just win? What? We're both just one. Oh yeah, they're they're both on they're both on right spin. By the way, oh my gosh, guys, revolve just one. Okay, you know we're we're, we're launching revolve first. Let's see. Maybe it's like the first one to be launched first. Like I don't know. Let's see. But ah, I I I'm so confused now. Like I thought I thought Eternal was like better at everything overall, but like revolve just one. I'm I'm so conflicted. Okay, looks like revolve might lose this one though. But let's see. Okay, but Eternal barely won. Okay, overall, I if you can't if you can't get Archer Hercules, but you have like a uh, Ragnarok, Revolve is not a bad driver. Revolve is actually pretty good. I'm actually like really surprised. I remember when I first got Revolve, like I got it on uh, Bla uh not Blaze Ragnarok, Rising Ragnarok, like a few months after Ragnarok released, because like back then, oh my gosh, back then um. I could only get like the Beyblades that like I really, really, really wanted. Like I, I could only get like, let's say I saved up a bunch of money to get Beyblades. So like I could only get like maybe like one Beyblade every like two months or something. So yeah, I was thinking like when I first got Ragnarok, I was like, oh my gosh, this Revolve driver, it's like so high tech. It's free spinning. It's awesome. And it comes with the gravity and gravity disc was like one of the heaviest discs at time. Okay, so honestly, they seem kind of like evenly matched, which is kind of sad. I, I, I thought Eternal was just gonna totally like demolish, but like they, they're actually not that bad. Like I think they have like decent stamina. It's basically whichever one's launched first wins. Actually, I'm gonna use both launchers. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to try to launch them at the same time. Like let's see how it works. Eternal. That's as close as we're getting. Anyway, so uh, yeah, when I got Revolve, it was like I was so hyped for it. I was like, oh my gosh, this Revolve tip is awesome, and like the gravity tip was awesome, and the gravity disc was awesome, but like the Ragnarok layer wasn't awesome. I also got a uh, Wyvern soon afterwards. That was the Beyblade I got afterwards. A uh, Wild Wyvern, and the Orbit tip was so good too. Like, oh, I am wow. Revolve just won. I I don't know, guys. I don't know. Is Revolve better than Eternal? Well, you know what? I'm gonna want Revolve first and then Eternal. Honestly, I think I think it's just whichever one spawns first. So I think I think they're actually evenly matched, which is kind of sad. Maybe Eternal has more life after death. Actually, I'm pretty sure Eternal might have more life after death. I kind of guys, do you see this? It's kind of like reverse color scheme. Like it's gold on the outside on the stock it's gold on the outside and blue on the inside. And on the recolor, it's blue on the outside and gold on the inside. That that is crazy, guys. Okay, so yeah, I think it's I think it's whichever one's launched first. So yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna stop paying attention to the battles now. We we already did our data analysis. They're they're pretty even, and I'm just. I don't know, I'm just gonna talk about random stuff now. I don't even, I don't even know what to talk about in these videos. It's kind of like, it's kind of like I just start recording a video and I, I have no idea what to talk about and then I just turn my brain off and then just random, random topics come to mind. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, guys. Also, the, um, what's it called? The, uh, 
Beyblade drawing design contest. I have not forgotten about that. I've just gotten like so many entries on the Beyblade drawing design contest thing that like I don't know what to do. Like I could make like a three hour video on it, but I don't want to talk for three hours straight. Or I'm thinking of doing this. I'm probably gonna show like uh, I'm gonna probably gonna pick like the top 20 or top 30 or something and make a video off those and the rest like the rest the ones that didn't make it into the top 20 or 30 I'm gonna like uh, put them at the end of every single video So like at the end of every single video, maybe I'll like review and show off like 10 Beyblade designs So yeah, I don't, I don't know. I mean, I'll probably do that, but probably not anytime soon I'm sorry guys. I'm a bit busy right now. I'm heading over to uh What's it called? And well, by, by the time you see this, I'm probably gonna be like in Chicago because like I'm going to see some uh, family members and stuff So I'm gonna have to pre-record that but once I come back from Chicago I will do the drawing contest thing. So yeah, expect that in like around like a week or two So yeah, let's let's see who wins this Oh, come on. I mean, they're both Spriggan, so like, you, well, what are you gonna do? Whoever wins, Spriggan wins. I, I hate it when, like, I do a battle between, like, Spriggan versus Spriggan, and then there's, like, that commenter's like, huh, I can read, the, I'm a psychic, I can read the future, I'm a fortune teller, I bet Spriggan is gonna win. Or, like, I bet Spriggan is gonna lose. Like, no way, Sherlock. But uh, it's kind of funny, honestly. Anyways, yeah, let's do last battle. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, that was a mislaunch. Let me do that again. Three, two, one, go. Two. Three, two, one. Two. Okay, let's see. Which one? Which one is the better tip? Revolve or eternal? I think we already answered that like halfway through the video. It's, it, they're both. They're both okay. They're both. They're both the same, I guess. I mean, it's kind of cool because like in deck format, like in the WBO uh, deck format, you can only use like one of every driver. So like, I guess if you wanted two revolves, you can have a revolve and eternal or whatever. That is pretty close, I and I launched Revolve first, so I'm tempted to say Revolve's better, like, it's gonna need more testing. So yeah, that is the battle between the Eternal Driver and the Revolve Driver. Remember where it comes subscribe. If you have any video suggestions, leave in the comments below. Please leave a like. I really like likes. They make me feel better. If you leave a dislike, uh, I cry myself to sleep, but you, you can also do that too if you didn't like the video. I, I don't even know what the dislike or like button does. It just kind of looks there and then it, it, the dislike and like button, What actually what it really does is either makes me feel really happy about myself or like makes me feel really sad about myself. So like if you want me if you want me to feel sad, I guess you can hit, hit the dislike button. But like, I know you guys are cruel like that. So you guys can do it if you want. I don't even, what am I even talking about? Why am I rambling? See you guys later. Have a nice day guys. Adios.